Evan Fletcher Brown here with Matt Stillwell. Still seven records, Matt Stillwell. Matt, welcome to Kicks Country. Thanks, Matt. It's nice we to are, be here. We are recording video for our website, and we have artists that come down from Nashville on a regular basis, and uh, they oftentimes they'll bring their guitars with them, and sometimes they'll bring other band members with them, and, they, and we'll, we'll talk, we'll chat with them on the air. But we figured, uh, why not let you, the listener, meet them and see them on our website, kicks96country.com. We appreciate you stopping by. Matt, we thank you for driving all the way down from Nashville. Thank you. from Nashville this morning? Uh, actually, Winston Salem from yesterday. Really? So yeah, I've had a little bit of a drive. You've been on the radio <laughs> tour? Is it? Well, yesterday I had a, a thing for CBS Morning News. Oh, uh, really? They they're doing a piece on Moonshine. Which, uh, <laughs> you know what my album's called Shine, and uh, <laughs> I did a. I got to hang out with Junior Johnson, who is he started NASCAR basically, mm -hmm. and uh, an old timer moonshiner, and just an awesome guy. And uh, actually got to drive him back to Winston Salem, so I spent like an hour in the car with him. That's the equivalent of like uh, hanging out with Merle Haggard and George Jones. <laughs> did you actually get any, Did you actually get any shine out of the deal? Oh yeah. Well, they uh, <laughs> we did it. Uh, we were at, I have to sponsor uh, Cat Daddy Carolina Moonshine, and they were doing their showcasing them. Uh, and then they let me do my song and all that stuff. But uh, yeah, we uh, I have some in the car. Really? Yeah. All right, we're gonna take a quick break. <laughs> um, so let's talk about the album. Yeah. Shine uh, is a, actually was the name of the first single, right? Uh, which was actually a top five on CMT and mm -hmm. a top ten video on uh, GAC. On GAC, yeah. All right, it's a great song. We played it here at Kicks Six. You may remember Max Till well Shine. The current yeah. single, Sweet Son Angel. Yeah. All right. Now, how many tracks we got? What um, we got ten on there, and um, you've written what? I wrote half of those, and we're uh, we're still coming with this album. We're gonna we're gonna do some repackaging in the beginning of the year, and uh, we're coming out with uh, Dirt Road Dancing, actually. Really? You're gonna repackage the, the CD and put some uh, bonus material, some live stuff, and a couple of new songs, and uh, the videos, the video for Sweet Sun Angel, which it's doing good too. Uh, uh, not as good as the shine did, uh, but uh, it's good. Of course, there's a Victoria's Secret model in it. So well, I actually, that. now your single uh, "Shine" actually um, did very well uh, on music downloads. Yes, we had we uh, there for a long time, especially when it, the video was doing so well. We were iTunes was good. Well, I'm, I'm curious about this as yeah. a new as a new artist, as a breaking artist. Obviously, you have great music, and people want to hear it. Um, are you finding that you're getting more play on the like the iTunes downloads or? I think so. Uh, yeah, as you know, it takes a long time just to kind of break down all the doors. Uh, you'll have pockets throughout the country that, that blow you up, you know, and there's some that just don't. But uh, the one thing that, that is kind of constant is the iTunes. It's the, the downloads, whether it's iTunes or Napster or, or whatever. Um, it's, it's pretty interesting to see the exposure that you get from that, uh, and also the video stuff. It tends to help out a lot. So you, so you personally, as an artist, you support, you know, like, hey, man, there's like, go to iTunes and find my music and get my music. Oh, yeah. Like, well, it's so much easier. And, you know, I found that I didn't realize the impact that I had because a lot of people sit at work or whatever, and they'll go and, and search for new stuff, uh, way more so than uh, necessarily like radio-wise, yeah. where, they, where they're, you know, listening for new stuff. They listen to radio because they like it. Yeah, exactly. They're like the people that are searching for new music go straight to iTunes and that kind of thing. So yeah, yeah, actually, I think that's, you're right. And those fans are the ones that uh, help build the following and, and do that kind of thing, which essentially will help break you at radio and, and all that stuff like that. All right, well, let's talk about the, let's talk about the new single. Let's talk about uh, Sweet Sun Angel. Was that yeah. one that you wrote? I did not write that. Okay. No. <laughs> I didn't. Well, I mean, I, the reason I, I, my producer brought that song to me, and I, I thought that it was a very cool song simply because it's, it's an up-tempo song. It, it talks about summer, which I like being out on the lake and, mm -hmm. and that kind of thing. Uh, it talks about good-looking girls. And, and that was, I felt like it would go, just knowing my crowd, you know, I've, I've been out playing for seven or eight years, uh, mainly in the southeast mm -hmm. uh, and mainly just being a guitar. But um, that's grown up a lot now, but I know who my audience is pretty much, and I knew that they would kind of dig uh, dig the song, and that's why we put it on the album. All right, well, I'll tell you what. Yeah. we got a pretty girl right over there. Yes, we do. Uh, she's getting some work done. But uh, would, you, <laughs> would, you, would you play your song to her? She's our sweet yeah. son angel. Would you, We're going to play you, sweet son angel? For our, for the, for <laughs> 696 is sweet son angel right over here. Um, <laughs> go ahead. Matt Stillwell, 696.
Back to Nashville. I will. Shine. That's the name of the album. Go find it on iTunes. We'll see you next time.